Good morning. The Orlando Gardener coming at you. Alright, I'm doing a video this morning on how to tell when your graph is taken. How to tell when your graph is taken. Now, there are many, 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 many different ways to do grafting. But I only do it one way. I graph one particular way. There's another way that I've learned recently. But as you can see right here, the one way, the one method that I do, uh, it is the one that's been successful to me over the years. It is the one that Sergio from South Florida, from the Truly Tropical videos, have taught me. Uh, but how do you know when your graph is taken? Right here. That is the proof in the pudding. Now that does not necessarily mean that you're in uh, the safe uh, place. Just because you see it pushing, which is an indication that it took, you're not safe. Um, this is an indication that it took, but what you really want to keep an eye on is that the scion stays green. Uh, uh, as long as the scion, I tell people all the time, as long as the scion is green, you're safe. Some people have scions on there for a few months and it and it does not uh, push anything. But that's cool. Sometimes it doesn't get that, but that's all right. As long as that scion is green, you have done your job. And eventually it'll push through the buddy tape. Now, um, one of the things that I do uh, when I'm dealing with um, uh, grafted trees is I keep them in the shade. There's no direct sun for me when it's... And this is a, a tree I did for a subscriber. But I keep, I keep them in the shade and I keep them watered heavily. And when I see the base tree... When I see the base tree start to, you know, want to grow, start to want to produce leaves and branches, I do that. I tear them off. This is the tree trying to grow. But I don't want any energy. I don't want any energy in growing these new branches. I don't want that. I want all the energy to go into the scion keeping this alive and getting this to grow basically staying alive so i come along and i tear all of these off every one of them when i see them trying to produce i get them out of the way so all of the tree's energy and resources can go directly into the scion okay this is the orlando gardener coming at you and just want to share that bit of information uh, with you how to tell when a scion has taken y'all have a good one